just like her discus, shot, and even her hammer throw. Kelsey Card is in some rarefied air. We haven't tried the jab. She might be able to do that, but we're not going to. Card is only the third collegiate athlete to throw over 60 feet in the shot and over 200 feet in the discus in her career. If you add her hammer throw, she's the only collegiate athlete to throw over 200 feet in the hammer and discus and over 60 feet in the shot. I always hoped that in discus I would get 200 feet and then in shot, in shot 60 as well because those are the big, the big numbers in the throwing world for women. We don't really talk records much. Uh, I've never high-fived her and said, hey, that's another school record or you know, anything like that. Uh, we're just trying to throw as far as we can every single time we go in the ring. That strategy has led Card to seven Big Ten titles in the last two years. But there was one big strategic move that helped Card reach her marks. After her sophomore year, she redshirted and completely changed her shot put style. Well, from seventh grade till halfway through sophomore year, I was considered a glider. But then spring break of our sophomore year, I was getting kind of stagnant with the, with the glide and I'm, I'm not going to get any taller and generally it's, it's taller girls that can do that. And so we decided to switch to the spin. So I kind of sold that to her on the plane ride back from Indoor Nationals uh, her sophomore year that rotational is the way to go. It's very similar to the discus, it's just in a smaller ring so it's a little more, a little more compact. So the transition, I mean it, it was hard, you know, trying to line everything up because it is still a little bit different from the disc, but I think I was lucky to have that discus background because I think that helped me transition. The switch to the spin helped Card add five feet to her throw as her heave of 60 feet 10 and 3 quarter inches ranks eighth all time and second in the NCAA this year. I think that's just really exciting and says a lot about the fact that the, the choice we made was a good one to switch to the spin. <laughs> in the discus, Card has added 20 feet since her freshman year. Her throw of 204 feet 2 inches ranks 10th all time and leads the NCAA this year. As for the hammer throw, Card's toss of 202 feet 4 inches was good enough for third place at the Big Ten Championships. But don't expect to see her in that event again. She really just uses it as a training tool. We would do it a lot, a lot of drills and turns and stuff for warm ups. So probably like every other day I would say warm ups and I'd throw it like once every other week sort of. We didn't really throw throw it that often. Card is focused on the discus and shot put. She's qualified for the NCAA championships June 8th through the 11th in Eugene. But as far as what new distances she can hit and what other titles she can win. The way practices have been going, I don't know. I, I hate to limit her. Uh, I think anything's possible. I, I don't even know what to say. It's just it's, it's fun because when I was younger I would see people like, like Danny Block and some of the older girls like Dorcas I see them win and I was just I always wondered kind of what that would be like and so it's just it's really exciting to to reach that 